do this. Now I should be able to do this correctly. <clears throat> I don't know why I'm crooked, but I am. <laughs> Hi, Karen. Uh, it, do I look crooked? <laughs> Because I am. I mean, I'm not, but my camera is. My phone is. Why is it crooked? Hi. I'm trying to straighten this sucker out. Here we go. There we go. Uh, all right. Hello. Uh, there we go. There we go. Hello, you guys. Hey. Hey. All right. Hopefully, everybody's going to load in real quick so we can get going right away. Uh, Hi. Oh, and Nanette, you and I both were up late, when, weren't we? <laughs> well, I guess technically I was up later. Because, I don't know. <laughs> Hi, girl. <laughs> uh, well, you guys, so much for cutting back. Because I have like 50 items. <laughs> Hi. Uh, yeah. I have 52, I think, actually. Possibly. But it's going to be fine. It's going to be just fine. Hello. Yeah. Well. Hi, Misty Girl. All right. We got 16 people. Let some, let's let some people filter in for a while. Because I might have... Uh, Went live a few minutes early. I'm not sure. Uh, Misty, I opened your package late last night. And I love my dream pad so much. Oh, look at these two, you guys. Look at the furry ears. And look at this head on the... Look at this horse. Oh, I love them. They're so good. They're so good. So, yeah. I have to... I have to uh, do my shelf. I have to do a lot of things. <laughs> yes, I surely do. Um, oh, 20 people. Come on, people. Yeah, I have had... Hi, Carrie. Um, I have had some issues with last night. I, can, I did three videos and everyone said, you're trying to do something for a past date or and I'm like what it was just ridiculous so um yeah I got some issues I gotta deal with so I'll take care of I guess I mean other than my regular life <laughs> issues hey tiger oh Cindy I know that's exhausting but a new house, that's exciting. Hello. So we are, um, oh, oh, oh. Oh, you do, Tiger? Well, then I should probably show, hey, Laurie. Uh, I should probably show one of my last items first if you're going to be leaving because you might be interested. I don't know. I don't know. So I'll show the last one. It's on the last page. And I will just... Uh, get Only 33. Come on, people. I need more than 33 people. But anyhow, let's get started. Why not? Right? All right, so 
You guys, I mean, look, in my opinion, and for what that's worth, right? But in my opinion, and because it's my sale, I think I have a right to my opinion, <laughs> right? Um, I know you're eating some ketchup chips from Canada. Hello. Hey, girl, other half. Um, in my opinion, boho is not only baskets and wicker, okay? <laughs> so I try to mix a few things up in there. Sometimes it's about color play, you know. Hey, sometimes, thank you. Uh, I might have uh, blow dried my hair to die. <laughs> yes. I showered and I blow dried my hair. <laughs> I didn't I didn't straighten it, so it's a little like, you know, I have a mind of its own. But anyhow, I thought these were I thought these kind of fit in with Boho. Um, I don't know why. When I saw them, maybe because I kind of thought of Tiger, but also, well, because I don't know if you can see this. But these are there you go. There you go. Can you see that? Oh, there you go. There you go. Purple. So, they're fancy. And I have a set of four of them. They are like, and they're like, you want to drink, you know? Hey. Aw, oh, thanks, you guys. Um, yeah, they're super pretty, aren't they? I love that purple. And they're, like, dark, but, like, then, if you're in the, oh, golly, with that, that window light coming through, oh, my goodness. Oh, I wish you could see this purple shade now. Mm, oh, it's so good. Oh, my gosh. If you could see what I'm seeing here, it's amazing. So, yeah, you're going to get some great purple here. And there, like I said, there are four of them. They are, I still want to find my little thing. I really don't think I looked. They're eight inches tall. They're about four and a quarter inches in diameter. They're awesome. There are four of them. And, hey, Carol. They're, um, they're $25 for the set of four. And they're number seven. Oh, I didn't see this either. This had 53 items. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> I can't help it. I can't help it. I have so... I, I cannot help it. <laughs> Sometimes I just... I get, you know... I don't know. I don't know what it is. Okay, did anybody... Oh, well, Tiger didn't even get them. Look at who got them, Miss Shirley Pearl. Shirley Pearl, thank you so much. All right, hold on a second while I write this down real quick because I, I just found something that I hadn't had in there. Oh, I love that thing too, by the way. It's awesome. And um, it didn't get. I didn't get. No. <laughs> well, it's all right. It's all right. Okay. All right. Back to the matter at hand. Miss Shirley Pearl. Got those. Oh, and I just turned the page like a doofus. Um, okay. Thank you, Shirley. Okay. Um, yeah. All right. We are on our way. Hi. Hey, Jeannie. Hey, everybody. All right. So this, I believe, is, um, like, it's like a, um, I have... I have a handful, I will just tell you guys right now, 
Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Out of 53 items, I have eight offer ups. Unless I get to certain things and you guys start screaming, do an offer up, then I will. Um, Because I know you guys like to do some offer ups because it gives you, you know, a little better chance to get it. So, um, you know, I'm fine with that. If you guys really want to offer up on something, just start screaming at me, okay? Anyway, um, this is a... Um, what? What did she say? Oh. <laughs> um, I think it's like a paperweight. It's a, it's like, I think it's a stone, a rock. You know, I'm calling it a rock flower. It does have a little, like, chippiness right there off of it. Just makes it look natural to me. I, I don't know if somebody tried to write something on the back of it there. I thought that her father had passed or, or was ill. I'm not sure. So, um, yeah, but I think that it's just like a, a cool, I mean, even if it's not a paperweight, it, it's just cool for something. It just looks cool. And uh, it's $8 and it's number 39. $8 number 39. You see, it's because the palm of my hand, maybe, if that. Deanna Dill, you got it. Thank you. Girlfriend, good to see ya. All right, I forgot this thing until this morning too, so I had to add it on. Um, and this matches um, some, uh, well, I think it goes, I don't know if it goes, it's the same set or what, but it matches to me. Um, hi, Mary. Hey, hey, Helen Booty coming in under her other alias. <laughs> um, I um had some similar butterflies for the wall that Angela Marksbury bought a while a couple a few weeks ago or something. Anyhow, so this to me is hello, hi Sally. Um, either a napkin holder. Or an envelope holder, like for, you know, on your desk or something. I I mean, to me, at first I was like, oh, it's a, it's a napkin holder. But then how many people have like wood, you know, butterflies and such like that? Oh, that's awesome. You know, you don't, I don't know how many people would put that in their kitchen or something. So, or maybe in their dining room, it would look cute. Or, but like I think it also would look cute with like envelopes and stuff and if you're having an officer area or whatever. So this is going to be $15 and it's number 43. $15 number 43. There's plenty of room in here too. So you got it, Helen. All right. All right. Okay. Um, this next item is actually um, a piece of pottery from uh, O'Keen Pottery. It's based out of uh, Wisconsin. So it um, it was confusing to me at first because I wasn't sure about this, but I realized last night after doing some research, it you can use it for soap or um, lotion. And you can go online on the um, O'Keen, which it's right here on the bottom, O'Keen Pottery, um, on their website and order the what fits on there. So um, no, it's, uh, it's for soap or lotion. So it's super beautiful. I mean, it's like, I love the top part with that. Like, look at that. It's a beautiful piece of pottery. That's so pretty. That etching. You see how big it is? 
it would be perfect in like a kitchen or bathroom for, you know, soap or whatever. Um, so, so yeah, if you do end up getting this, like I said, it's on the bottom, Okeen Pottery. And yeah, and that's why I would, I said, and I, I commented back. I don't know if you saw that because I saw it last night. I usually research things the night, the night, um, hey Maria, um, before uh, a sale. Because, you know, why would I be doing it any earlier than that? That would be, I'm um, not waiting until the last minute. But anyhow, um, it's a beautiful piece of pottery. And like I said, if you go on their website, then they have the things that fit. You know, it's not always easy to find the right fit or look or whatever. So, yeah, you'll want to be able to do that if you if you want this. Um, this is going to be $18 and it's number 10. $18, number 10. So beautiful, natural looking. If you're into just like some simplicity and everything, I certainly do. I certainly do have it here. <laughs> that little hobnail plastic one. I do, Nancy. <laughs> oh, my glasses distract me from work. Um, you're welcome. Or I'm sorry, Dolores. I'm not sure what to say. <laughs> All right, so $18. And number 10, I don't think I got anybody. And I don't know if there's a leg, so. All right. Um, right. I'll do that little butterfly um I'll I'll pull it in a minute it's actually <laughs> I have to get inspired so I'll I'll get there Lorian <laughs> All right I have this little cloisonne trinket box It's, you know, you see how big it is, right? It's turquoise enamel on the inside and on the bottom. It's really lovely little thing here. $12 and it's number 24. It's $12 and it's number 24. Yes, make sure you give me a thumbs up, okay, while you're here. <laughs> well, I just did one butterfly and I'll do the next, I'll do the other one next and they'll be done. I think that's all I have. That's a, I think that's all I have that I can see. That box has butterflies. That box. <laughs> All right, we'll go with this one. Okay, this little, it's all its own, on its own. I don't have a match for it. It's from Burwood, that one I was holding. Had butterflies? Oh, I didn't see. No. Oh, it does. I'm sorry, there's a butterfly right there. I didn't see that. <laughs> you are correct. There it is. And there they are. <laughs> All along the end. I didn't even see them. Thank you, Maria. I see flowers at first. Now I do see the, yeah. Yeah. So there you go. So again, if anybody's still interested in that, that was um, $12 and number... Uh, 24. <laughs> that was a very good, um, good eye, Maria. Hello, Julia. Okay, Dolores, then you got that. <laughs> That's funny.
<laughs> All right, so this one, the Burwood one, it's a single, and it has a hook on the back. It's plastic. It's white hobnail, and it is, oh, did I not turn the page on? It's $8, and it's number 20. $8, number 20. Hi, Kelly. Suzanne, you got it. Suzanne Lover. All right. Well, we got all the butterflies out of the way. <laughs> all right. So next up is I think this thing is so cool. And um, I mean, I guess you would probably see it as an egg because it, you know, it's clearly egg shaped, but it's a very cool candle, right? It does have one little like ding in it. <laughs> if you even notice, you know what I mean? It's like kind of like just, Turn it around and and then you don't really see it, right? So it's gonna be six dollars and it's number forty. Six dollars number forty. Tiger, you got it. Thank you. Okay, this is, so you guys, this item, I cleaned the cover, and um, I end up taking some color off, <laughs> just a little, just a little bit of the red, but, and, and I didn't do the side as much, because I'm leaving it, it was so gross and dirty, it was like thick. And so, I don't know if I took off the wrong color. I don't know. But I think it's just fine. It is... <coughs> excuse me. It's not a dar. But it is made in Belgium. Here it is right there. You can see it. It's kind of cool in that it's sitting on this... It's like... It's not footed, but it's got like a pedestal, right? And, you know, it, it could be tightened so that, you know. And then this comes off. It's a little, you know, rusty and stuff, but it's super pretty. pretty. Hello. Hi, Tammy. And it's just, it's just got that nice, like, old, beautiful, worn look that is just so lovely and you know stack of books put that on there or stack of books some other stuff something else behind it and then this in the front i can see that happening too <laughs> hey Lori. so this is 15 dollars, and it's number eight 15 dollars, number eight it's very pretty you got it, Diane. I love this so much. Oh, I just think this is the coolest thing. I don't know. Look, I don't know what you're going to want to put in there. Nor do I really know what was in there. But you might want to get this tightened. Just, you just need a regular screwdriver. I just haven't, you know, done that. Um, I am not doing anything with the patina because I love patina. You are more than welcome to wear your arms out <laughs> and shine this puppy up. If that's your look. I dig patina. Potpourri pot is very possible because it would make sense in that, you know, it's kind of, 
I wouldn't say it's been roached out in there, but it's definitely something's been done in there. But yeah, it's like I would think it's for all those kind of things, like put some sage in there or some incense, because you know you've got these over it. But you know, it's definitely been sitting on some kind of heat at some point too. I think. So anything, you know, you guys know, you do what you want with it, right? I mean, you want to be careful. You don't want to, like, use certain things for food items because, you know, depending on what something has been made out of, you don't know if something is food safe. So don't be, like, eating or drinking something out of these things. But, yeah, just to just to make some coffee in here and let that scent go and not drink it, but let that scent go all over your house. That's amazing. Yeah. What does the border look like? It is... It's hard to describe. Let me just get closer. Because to me, <laughs> to me, it's like you see like little whales a little bit. That's how I mean. I see all kinds of things. So it's just a, a different design. Nothing um, like I don't see necessarily flowers or, you know, anything like that. So it is cute, though, isn't it? And it's. Do you see my hand size? It's just a cute, I I just love it. it. Yes, yes, sort of a little bit, yeah. So um this is gonna be $15 and it's number 32. Yes, it just looks so cool, right? Why am I selling it? <laughs> I'm kidding. You guys, I have to. My whole, my whole, you got it, Nettie. Thank you. My whole, like, jam is to find things that are my jam and share them with you, <laughs> to be quite honest. I mean, because, like, like, we say this all the time. We can't keep everything. We can't. And let me just say, if you, like, so I love boho. But I also love um, mid-century, and I also love rustic, and like I call my style flea market fabulous. <laughs> but if I if I had to go all hey hey girl hi Celeste, um if I had to go like all if I had to pick one thing and it could not be boho, it would be mid-century. I just love it so much. And hey, hey Sue, I am going to be having next week in Tuesday sale some beautiful Franciscan. No, Julia, I forgot. Oh my gosh. I have not. I am so sorry. Um, I am so behind. I will do that after this because I can't stand to not open something. <gasps> oh, sorry, sorry. I forgot. I am so behind on things. Um, hey, Steve. So, yeah, um, I'm going to have some um, seeing Franciscan. I'm going to have a set of four. Uh, for, I think I have plates, cup, saucer, and I think a bowl. I'm not, I can't remember. But a set of four. Anyhow, it's so cool. Um, all right, what are we gonna do next here? Green. Oh, here this thing. <sighs> the straw holder. Now. Oh, no problem, Tiger. Um, this, yeah, it's not, it's it's not, and this does need to be cleaned out. Um, it's not the the one that I was hoping. Or thinking, it, you know, like with the for the barbicide or whatever, it definitely would be more likely to be straws. But you know, if you don't you look. You do you. <laughs> you do whatever you want with this thing. But it, you know, it has like tiny bit of red, like there it would have maybe had the would have said straws and had a, like five cents or something or or soda. I don't know what it would have said. It doesn't matter. You do you. This thing is super cool. It is a little tall. It's well to the to the top of this here, just about around eleven, maybe just past eleven. 
So it's really cool. No, no, I don't. I, I, I didn't even try, but I doubt it. And I don't have my little thing here. No, I think it's in my purse. Um, so it's, uh, oh, it is $25 and it's number 15. $25, number 15. Today is the day I should have gotten two drinks because this is tasting delicious today. Oh, that's very nice of you guys to say that. I know I appreciate that patience. It's for me, it's pretty important. Well, yeah, that's what it, if a lot of times for that barbicide, but then I don't know if it would have like on, something on the bottom to drain it. Um, I'm not sure. Yeah, the barbicide. Mm -hmm. It can be either one. But yeah, you can definitely... Hey, girl! Um, definitely use it for straws, too, or whatever. Mm -hmm. All right, nobody? All right, we'll put it aside here. Oh, darn it. Oh. Well, hopefully that didn't go somewhere. I can't find it. All right. All right, this next item is, I should have measured it also, um, just under seven inches. It is, um, it might have been Napco. It does, I, I left that on there, but it does have a number. Don't know. But this is like an olive-y kind of green, and then there's like more of a sage-y kind of green, and then like white, you know? And, you know, again, oh, gosh, I got something in my eye. Sorry. Ugh, something in my eye. Um, I'm trying to see if I have, like, a spam of some sort. Because this is what I would have needed for today's sale. Would have been nice <laughs> if I was prepared. But I am not. So let's just pretend... That this pencil is a beautiful flower. <laughs> you know, sometimes you have to be very uh, imaginative. Hey, Beth. So, yeah, it's just, it's a really nice size. And it's really pretty in the colors. And it is $12. And it's number 45. $12, number 45. Very pretty. Thank you. <gasps> Hi, Polly. Tammy Tidbits, you got it. Um, thank you. I washed it and I dried it today. I blow dried it so it was be it'd be mostly straight. It would have been nice if I would have um, straightened it, but that's a lot of work. All right, you guys, this next item, it is, um, it's kind of my favorite item of the show. And I know it's weird to say this because it doesn't seem to be much of anything. But it really is. And I, I really dig it. And I'm really not sure why I'm getting rid of it. Because this is something that you can really use. I'm going to tell you that right now. You know, a ton of ways. So, here it is. Here's the top of it. How it looks. And then there it is. Okay. Now see, right here, you got this. Right? Right? Give it a lift. Um, you could put a candle on it. You could put a beautiful, oh yeah, this is going to be in the sale. Yes, it is. A beautiful picture on it. 
You could put another beautiful item on it. You could put this on it. You could put a little, um, like a tiny, like doily. Let's pretend that's a doily. You, again, imagination, people. And then set that. There are so many things that you could do using this as a lift. It's something other than what we generally use and that being books, you know, or you, you can put this on top of books too and give it more lift. This is made in India and I'm over a hundred. Yay. But I need those thumbs up. You guys, it's just, yeah, you could put a glass on there. It's just right. Right. Cindy. It is a great riser. It's so different, but it's, I mean, and again, this is, this definitely fits in um, with like the, um, yes, 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 yes. And yes, you guys are all given ideas. That's what I, see, this is what I mean. Sometimes you just, you know, you might have passed this up at Goodwill, you know, or a thrift store or wherever. And you don't always see something for what it can be, right? And then somebody else comes along and it's like, wait, that will look amazing with my Dunk Dunkin' drink on it. <laughs> I mean, I just love it. I think it's super cool. And it is $10 and it's number 23. <laughs> Okay, who got it? Looks like Dolores. Dolores. And I never again know. Is it Cowie? I think they all they all say Cowie or something like that. See, but I'm never sure if it's like David Bowie, Cowie. It's it is Cowie. Okay. All right, Dolores. And I asked you that before because I know you've bought from me before. And also you got something earlier. So yay. Um, okay, so. Let's do this bell. Isn't it pretty? It's so pretty. It's got the little dinger, clacker, whatever. And then it's got this long, thin stem. Um, it is just under six inches tall with that. I just, there's something about like something like this. Just something very simple. A bell doesn't need to necessarily have this for me. Okay. I just like the look. But it, it's super cool, right? So this is going to be $8. And it's number 16. Yeah, it does sound good. But you guys, let me just tell you. I found something yesterday. Um, oh, oh, surely <gasps> it's not for sale, but I don't know. Oh, is it in my, I don't know if it's in my hall or not. Um, it's, I'll show it to you. Dolores, you got it, girl. Hi, Sandra. How can I bid? When, um, when I show an item, I will talk about it for a while and I'm a good talker. So I will talk. <laughs> and at some point I will say the amount, uh, how, hi, Cindy. I will say how much something is, and then I will give the number. When I give the number, the, if you're the first person to enter the number, then I will, um, yeah, Joelle, I'll show it in a minute. Um, then you will win it. Like uh, Dolores just won this again. And then there are also times, like the one I'm going to do very soon, where I will do something called an offer up. And it is similar to what some people would call an auction, but we don't do auctions on um, YouTube. We just do offers. We take offers and, and you kind of make offers um, to what you would want to spend on an item if you want. It usually is on like an uh, item that is more in uh, more desirable or more valuable. Um, if you could email me your information, that would be great. My email is comfycozyliving at gmail.com. Um, 
possibly Joelle or somebody could pop that in there for me. And let me just show you guys this because it's awesome. I'm probably going to be putting it up later today. I would have done it yesterday, but, you know, I get busy. And by busy, I mean lazy. <laughs> but this is so good. And I'm sorry I can't. I, I'm sorry I couldn't find 20 of them so we could all have one. I do not know where this came from. Because you know this is new. But look at this. Look at this, you guys. <gasps> Isn't this everything? I am, I like, you guys, I it's like a swing. But it's like a boho swing. And it's a shelf. And oh. Isn't it everything? I got it for $15, you guys. And I am so sorry. <laughs> but I am not giving that up. I mean, maybe for like a hundred. <laughs> I can do it. But that thing is something, isn't it? I gotta see what you guys said. Oh, thank you, Dolores. I got it on Evine or something when Evine was still. That part is called the clapper. Clapper. Okay. I always call it the clacker and I, I'm just, yeah, yay. Oh, oh, hi, Christy. Um, I always call it the clacker. I'm always thinking of, um, yeah, I am keeping that. I just wanted to show it. Um, I always think of in, um, in N25. What does that mean? N25. Oh, yay. <laughs> clacker does make more sense right um yeah she's i don't know who's out there well i i didn't mean to tease but she asked about it and i had to show but it's awesome isn't it oh i love it i mean i just got it saturday and i saw it and i was like i have to have that i have to have that I mean, I've been wanting to do some. My wall has been feeling very like not, not bal, not that it's not balanced, but I just felt like I wanted it to be more, and um, and that's gonna do it because it's everything. I love it so much. Anyway, okay, next, how about this little guy real quick here? I love the color of it. It's so good. This green. It's like a like a juice jar i guess but i would i call it like a glass uh like a, a cat or i read the word cat <laughs> clap on clap off <laughs> oh you guys um for like a little candle in there you know the um you know the kind i'm talking about the like why don't i have one of those here at my hands i mean i could go get one but eh. You know what I mean? The little battery op operated tea light I think would look super cute in this. Oh, excuse me. Or um, you could definitely go out in my yard right now and get some dandelions that look really good. And then you'd have green and gold. Yes, you would. Yeah, like a jelly jar. That's how I figure it. And it, it's, it's not like, it's like flashed on or whatever you want to call it. Cause you can see like a couple spots, like right there where it's you know not perfect, but it's so cool. Yeah. Packers, Polly. It's just really cute. Right. I like the design. I like everything about it. It's $8 and it's number 27, $8 number 27. <laughs> Well, you know, something for everybody. <laughs> okay. Are you guys ready for an offer up? Um, what might be one of the coolest items in the sale. Hi, Pamela. Are you ready? I need a sip. Look at this. Oh my God. 
Okay, here's the cover. Look at that. Look at it. Isn't it cool? It's like got a tropical kind of a vibe with this um, fabric. Okay. I just dig this so much. Okay, so it's a box basically. And I mean, this would be good for like keeping, you know, if you, you do like birthday cards and stuff like that. Um, you know what I mean? Like, um, yeah, definitely giving me Hawaii, but also totally boho with the, oh, uh, just, mm, I love it. The vibe of it all. Um, so you could definitely use this for like, just throwing mail inside that you don't want to look at, keeping envelopes. You know, sometimes you just need to you know, like, where's your address book and some envelopes and some pens and some paper, notepad, whatever. Um, or you can keep some um, wrapping paper in here. Yeah, definitely bills. Hide those away. You know, stuff like that. It's hard to, you know, think about it right now, but there's so many things that we just need to have out of sight, right? Oh, yeah, printer paper in your office for sure. Then this goes, see, so you can see it right there. And then, ah, uh, look at that. Or, I mean, if you feel like a, being a super awesome human being, and you know somebody that totally digs like the boho vibe. Hey, Angela. Oh, Angela. I feel bad because I sold this envelope holder slash napkin holder and it totally goes with the things you got. And I hate to show people what they missed, but I'm sorry, but I thought about you. Um, but anyhow, if you are awesome and you'd be willing to give this up, I mean, if you have somebody like a daughter or a brother, I mean, I'm best friend or whatever that's so super into like all the vibe all, you know all the boho you could use this as a gift box right and okay like say you buy them this beautiful scarf okay that is going to be in the sale you could fit that in here and then say you buy them this little coin purse you can put that in there oh let's say you buy a candle, which would go in here. I don't want to try to pull it out right now. And then, um, say you bought them this, um, cute little, um, paperweight that will fit in there. Maybe you'd like to include a few, um, you know, of their favorite chocolate bars or something. And you could individually wrap everything still and put it all in here and make it fun. And then you put this on. Then you give this to them. And they're like, oh my God, that is gorgeous. I would love this. And then you open it and you're like, oh my God, you got me all these presents too? I mean, what? Do you, do you hear what I'm saying here, people? This is like, talk about an amazing gift box. If I mean, if you're willing to go that route. Yeah, super cool. So we're, oh, I am such a dork. It's an, it's an, it's an offer up. Why do I always forget that part? It's an offer up. Misty's yelling at me. I can hear her right now. Michelle, <laughs> we're starting at 15 on this. I am so sorry. We're starting at 15 on this. Oh, you guys, you've got to tell me. <laughs> I got to remind myself. I know it's my job. So, okay. Well, Julie is at 15. So yeah. Wouldn't that be cool as like a gift box? Or, you know, like for hiding your bill. I know you are. I know you, Misty. She's like, Michelle, Michelle, Michelle. She was probably saying, Michelle, if it's an offer up, start it, Michelle. <laughs> anyway, or, you know, you could um, use this as a basket and then you could prop this just for the, you know what? You could even hang this on your wall. 
You could hang this part on your wall easily. It's it's gorgeous. And then you could use this, like, you know, in your office or whatever for, you know, loose papers or your printer paper or whatever. <laughs> right back at you, girl. So Sue is at 16. We got Sue Golombeski at 16. And let me give you a measurement on this. Because this thing is so beautiful. And it's, it's, and we got Julie at 17. It's about 11 and a half by eh, like 10 and a quarter, 10, maybe 10, 10 and a quarter. You know, and I'm talking about the whole thing. And we got Sue at 18 then. We got Sue at 18. We got Julie at 20. Isn't that cute though? Oh, yes, your junk journal clippings. Sue is at 21. Julie is out. I got Sue Golombeski at 21. I don't see anyone else that was in the in the offer up. So I'm just going to call it at uh, $21 for Sue Golombeski. Thank you so much. All right. Now I have to get up because... Um, my next item fell. <laughs> Sorry. Hopefully, it's accessible. Yeah. Get stiff. Oh, there it is. Okay. Ah. Uh. All right, so here it is. It's a little fan, okay? But, and I will show you how I had it <laughs> displayed because this next item, this I mean, this is the next item. Thank you so much, Christy. This I got, I got online. It used to be Evine, and then I think it was, um, well, I think Home Shopping and QVC are all, Owned by the same company now, so I don't know what it is, but I think it's um, by Indigo Thread Company. Is it? Can you see it? I don't know. Does it say Indigo Thread Company? I don't know. I'm sorry. But um, they have really cool clothes. And I bought several things from them. Thank you. I and I love it. I I really do. I love I, I love this. And um, it's just one of those shirts that um, it's like good for one. I, I mean, I'm only wearing it today because it's you know bohoey, <laughs> but it's a good shirt to wear even when it's warm out because it's very thin. But if you want to be covered, you know, and not like heavy, you know. So, okay, let me show you this next item. It's only as big as my hand. It's super tiny. It's so cool. Watch. Lisa, you're going to love this. It's made, uh, made the, made the, it doesn't say in, the People's Republic of China. And I did it like in, uh, like I had it on display in here. But, like, actually, this would be better because the smaller hole there. But you can, like, put this in any kind of, uh, any kind of setup. Isn't it pretty? Okay, a couple of peacocks. I know. It is only $8. 
and it's number 48. $8, number 48. <laughs> Thanks, cats. Okay, I got Cindy J. Thank you, Cindy. All right, this next item. Oh, so cool. True teal. True teal. Look at this bottom. Look at this. Look at this. Isn't this cool? Ugh. So it's a glass bottle in there. Okay, first let me get you the... It's, it's about seven and a half inches, maybe just under seven and a half inches. Isn't this amazing? You got like this woven or weave down here a little tighter. Then on here, it's a little wider. So you can see inside if you have anything inside. I don't know what you would, you know, if you want to collect some pennies or I don't know. Do people do that anymore? I don't know. Um, I would use it for, you know, like feathers or um pompous grass or something like that. Again, these are things that I wanted to have in here for display purposes. And as I get this more organized, I will like try to have things like that on hand. Because I don't want to go pulling it out of my own, you know what I mean. Teal bag with the feathers on the door. <laughs> That's just one of my, um, one of my reusable bags. And actually there's items in there that I want to send to Liz Retros. I keep forgetting to do that. <laughs> But anyhow, and then it, this, like, it's, like, braided as a handle on here. I don't know why it would be like this. But so you could kind of hang it even on a, a hook or something that would give a whole different kind of interest. It's just so great. I love it. It's $15, and it's number four. $15, number four. You sure did. I have some things for her. I've had them for a long time. Yes, Carol. And Carol, didn't you ask me about the sleeve? If you're the one, I think it was you, um, that asked me about the sleeve. It does, right? So, um, $15, number four. Did anybody say anything? Okay. Um, $18, Carol, let me know, and then I'll write you down. I have it right here. I just, you know, I, I, you know, I've been wanting to get back to you, but you know me. All right, so nobody, nobody on this one? Okay. Okay. Next item is... Um, this, yes, okay, let me write that down real quick. Carol. All right, cool beans. All right, um, okay. So this next time, it's kind of like a drip glaze kind of pad um, planter. It's um, a little short, you know, shorty short. It'll be cute for like a succulent or something in there. Um, I will show you this. I, I got this at... where I, I think I got this in a lot or something. It does need to be cleaned up a little bit. And it does have a crack. So... I'm showing this right here. I was going to keep it. And then I was like, well, let me give them the option if they want it, you know, because it's super cool. And it's, um, it's like four, just over four inches. And I'm giving a good price on it because of that, you know, crack or whatever. Here's your thing. <laughs> just fell into my face. There we go. So, um, even though that crack is there, I don't, let me look at this right for a second here. The crack doesn't go through to the other side. 
So it, the crack is right there, but it doesn't go through on that side. I don't see it on the inside. So um, it's just super cool. It's going to be $8, and it's number 13. <laughs> There's even a stone stuck. <laughs> I just haven't cleaned it up because it's just kind of, and I, I kind of like the way it's kind of like got that crusty stuff on there. <laughs> $8, number 13. Oh my gosh, I got some good things coming up. Yeah, oh, really? You don't like the word crusty? Hmm. Rusty, crusty, and dusty. Okay, next item is another one of these super cool candles. I just think these are the neatest things. This one has a little, like somebody must have dinged it. I don't know how this happens, you know, but you, I mean, I guess I do know. People are not careful, and this is why you have to have these things, um... Shine a light and what? Um, that's why you need to have these things wrapped. I don't care what people say. It, I don't care if they don't like you to wrap every, have to wrap everything. Um, it's your job. I'm sorry. I don't like to be rude, but like I don't want, I don't want to pay. Oh, <laughs> uh, oh yeah, that would be. You know what? Let me go run and get my my um my black light because that's the only. Thing I have that I don't know if this will like give the idea of uh, give, give the full impact of it, but yeah. What Christy is saying is if I shine a light on there, in there, you'll see how the light, how the candle goes. Well, you can, yeah, it's hard to see, but you can kind of see the difference. Oh, it's hard to, but you can definitely see it. Uh, I don't know. It's hard on something like this. But anyway, ah, sorry. They're super cool. I like them. <laughs> so anyhow, it's going to be, because of this ding, I'm just going to do $10. $10. And um, it is made in China, but still, it's this is just a cool, and this is totally boho. $10, number two. $10, number two. In a row I'm doing not well okay this next item is gonna be an offer up <laughs> I'm telling you now it's gonna be an offer up and we're gonna start it at $12 which is ridiculously low um this is beautiful in my opinion again offer up starting at $12 this is gorgeous it is what well, I call it. I'm calling it a Victorian heart. I don't know. But you see the outside has this purple, like doily-ish, whatever. I think this would look so gorgeous with like a special brooch or like a cameo or a few brooches 
or like some hat pins stuck in there, you know, like kind of straight down like that. Yeah. But I mean, I see things for what you could use them for, not always what they actually are. So we got Brie Gia at $12. And I mean, like you, then you can hang this somewhere and it'll be on your decor. It's gorgeous. And, um, you know, I just think it would look nice with special. Yeah, there you go. Rebecca Lance at 15. I just think it's, it's so lovely and it would look so pretty with like something special on it. Yes. Display it on a wall with vintage purses. That would be so good. Yep. Yep. That's how, that's what I, when I saw it. I thought right away brooch brooches. Like even if you just have like a special cameo that you got like when your grandma passed or something. And that would just look so pretty, you know? Or if you have a few little, you know, like rhinestones or, you know, something like that. It would look just beautiful. Even if you didn't put anything on it, it would look fine because it's just pretty. It's got this, like I said, this, see the, the ends? It's all purple. It's, it's, these are, this is gorgeous, you guys. This is, I mean, this ribbon is pink, but it's clearly been on there quite some time. So we got Cindy J at 16. Yeah. <laughs> Cindy J at 16. Rebecca's at 18. I mean, yeah, you could definitely use it in your Valentine decor. I would just use this all the time if I had the right, you know what I mean? Like, I just think, you know, if I had the right, if, if this was more my decor. Or, like, if you have, like, a gallery wall, this would look cute in there. Like, if you have, like, old pictures of family and stuff. Or you get an old picture of your grandmother and then Elaine is at 20. The colors aren't coming through. Well, this is just a very pale pink. And it's almost good that it's so pale that you don't, you know. But that that purple is coming through, isn't it? I It looks like it's coming through. I mean, it's like a lavender. It's very light. And then inside, the satin on the, on the inside is a very pale pink. Elaine is at 22. Yeah, and I that's what I was saying. Like, I think hat pins would look fine. Because you can get them, you know, you don't want to put them straight through. You put them like that. And I think they would look amazing on there. And there's like an old, you know, I don't know how you would wash this or clean it. You know, there's like a little bit of like staining, like, I don't know, or aging on that front. You could turn it this, this you could turn it whichever way you want, you know. So Elaine is at 25. I just think, you know, I just think. Some kind of beautiful, Rebecca is out, some kind of beautiful brooch or piece of jewelry that was handed down. Um, it, I don't know. It might have been. I don't know. Yeah. So it looks like Elaine is, Elaine Linney at 25 is going to be going home with this, <laughs> so to speak. So we got Elaine Linney at 25, and I am calling that. Thank you very much, Elaine. And I think you're going to really like it. It's gorgeous. I saw this and I was like, I, I could see exactly what we're like, all the things I just was saying to you guys, how I picture it. I, it just like all came to me a crazy being fun. Um, where is this? <laughs> Where is the candle stick holder? Okay. Oh, there it is. It's under here. <laughs> I'm like, where's my next item? Hmm. Okay. Next up is just a simple brass candle stick holder. Yeah, that that's what it is, but. Um, when it's something so beautiful, I like to give all the ideas of what you would want to use it for these days. Back in the day, yeah, that was just going to be stuffed away in a closet. Nowadays, that's way too gorgeous to be just shoved in a closet. So this is just a, a basic candlestick holder. But, you know, it's very in, in, in uh, keeping with all the 
Oh, I just have some, just, just, just peeling off a little bit of a uh, candle wax there. Um, very much in keeping with the boho vibe with a lot of the brass and things like that. I don't have a whole bunch of them this time around. I don't think I just don't, didn't get to them anyway, at least. So this one is going to be just, and it already has a nice felted bottom. This one is going to be $6 and it's number 37. It's only $6. It's got a good weight to it. And $6, number 37. Six dollars, number thirty-seven. All right, next up is hello, proud American. Um, next up is just the top thirty-seven. All right, you got it, Bree. Thank you. Um, I I got this. It's cracked and it's only the top, but it's cracked in a way that, I mean, you can see the crack. Let me show you. Okay. So it goes, there it is. See the crack? Right? But it's all intact. Do you know what I mean? Like you don't, you don't feel it on the inside. You can see it, but you can't. Matter of fact, you really can't feel it anywhere except right here on the inside, right, right there, because it's at that lip, and that's the only place you can feel it. So you cannot, you could turn this, okay? Because right now, okay, even when I show it to you, you almost miss it, right? You see it when I show you, okay? But then if I turn it around, blah, 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 then, you know, it's not always, it's not so bad. See, you know, like that, you don't see it. So you can turn this around to the back. <laughs> no, somebody might have broken their base beyond repair. I've sold tops and bottoms separately. And I know some people would say, just, just save them until you have a match. But, like, I'm... What if you only need a top? <laughs> I'm here for you. Or you can be creative. See, like I like I was saying the other day, like you could totally you do what you want to do. You might have something and you could you might have a beautiful plate and you could set this on and just use one of those fake, you know, the the LED little things, tea lights. Or whatever. Do you? But it's already cracked, so you already know this. And like I said, just turn that to the back. Nobody's even going to know. Would you even know then? There it is. Stars and bars. Okay. It's gorgeous. A little crack ain't going to kill you. <laughs> well, it's, it's only going to be, I'm going to sell this for $15. $15, number 26. $15, number 26. And I think, there you go, Cindy. Thank you. Hi, Londa. Londa. Thank you, Cindy. I honestly, you guys think that you, you have to be a little forgiving sometimes with your items. Um, we, for the most part, so many of us, definitely Misty and I, buy items that you have to you have to ha have a little forgiveness to these items they have had their lives and we're just prolonging them right because they're beautiful and who even cares with these little you know little chippies and stuff like that sometimes what i'm drinking until the end my nostrils can't <laughs> eh, that's funny oh you guys so anyhow okay well, there, I'll show you this then, since I already did. This marble ashtray is so gorgeous. Isn't it? Look at the veining in there. 
this again, uh, ashtrays are not just for smoking cigarettes, people. I am 100% against smoking. If you smoke, that's you do you. I, I, I know plenty of people that smoke. I still love or like them, <laughs> but I don't like smoking. However, this is usable for incense, sage, other things that, you know, people smoke. Um, all of the things these days, okay? Or you can use it for your keys and your chains. You can do whatever you want. It's a beautiful piece. Yeah, for a plant, definitely. It's a beautiful piece. Look at this. I mean, it's got a little weight to it. It's um, almost six inches, almost six inches in diameter. Oh, you got it. No problem, Carol. Thank you. Oh, well, you know what? Because I've done it before, so I, I knew that somebody would probably be interested. I'm sure a few people are probably interested um, because, you know, look, I know that a lot of people can get, yeah, and me included, I can get pretty good money for a fairy lamp. Um, I also know that me being as a buyer can't always afford to pay what some people pay for things at our sales. I know that for that uh, on the other side of the spectrum for me. So um, when I can get something like that, that you can simply turn around and it still looks like what everybody else paid top dollar for. You don't have a bottom, but you can use something else that's still lovely or beautiful. I'm, I'm still, look, I, I'll help you put it together <laughs> if you need help with it because... Part of the, part of what we do is the whole idea of even what Goodwill is based on, right? Reduce, reuse, recycle. We are trying to keep things out of the landfill. We are trying to have, and nowadays, even more difficult, we need to try to get more young people to appreciate the beauty of these items because you got generations coming in like my daughter, my son, they hate this stuff. They really don't care too much for it. You know what I'm saying? See? Yeah. So, um, you know, we've got to find some of the young ones to continue on. Um, you know, honestly, like, do we want all these new subdivisions around us? Maybe not, but I'd rather have a subdivision filled with people, you know, families, than to be surrounded by landfills. Because, you know, that's... That's where these things go, people. These things go. You don't all maybe live where you see that. I do see that where I live. And it really can make you think about it. So um, everything can't be burned down and everything. Some things just, you know, when they talk about a carbon footprint and all that, that stuff is real. So anyhow, off my soapbox now. <laughs> I, I just like, I am all for making things work in different ways. And also if you guys find, I will just say, I am basically going to offer what a service of sorts. If you love something that I'm selling. Yeah, I think so. I'm trying. Um, if you find something that you love that I sell, that I'm selling, and you're like, I have no idea what I will do with that, but I love it. First of all, just buy it. If you love it, just buy it. If you can afford it, buy it. And then email me and say, Michelle, I love that piece that I bought. I have no idea what to do with it. I will help you figure it out. Okay. I mean, to me, it's all about like just giving it another life. You know, 
girl, you know I'm coming. I am coming to Arizona one of these days. I am. Girl needs a getaway. If I had like a camper that I could sleep in, I would hit the road right now. Um, or if I had like, I wish I had like miles or something or, you know what I mean? Like, Diana, from your lips to HGTV's ears. <laughs> I wish. Um, I um, wish I had like points or something for hotel stays or something like that. I'd be I'd be hitting it because I would love to jump on an airplane and go somewhere right now for a long weekend. I am just oh we're coming, Cindy. We're coming. You know we're coming there soon. That's probably one of our first. Yeah, I know, right, Polly? Oh my gosh, yes. Okay, so this beautiful ashtray is getting heavy. It's eighteen dollars and it's number nine. You know, let's not forget. <laughs> oh pamela you did not just say that pamela don't tell don't tease me don't you dare tease me because i will stay in somebody's this girl i, mm, I will stay in guest room I ain't scared. I'm a single. Nobody's going to kill me in my sleep. I got like cat-like reflexes. I, I don't have cat-like <laughs> daily, but when it comes to protecting, like, you know, my kids and stuff. <laughs> oh, I'm on my way to Arizona. Let me see if I can get cheap flight on, uh, what you call it? Uh, frontier. <laughs> I don't know if they come. I gotta see where. I know where you live. It starts with a P. I don't know which airport is close to. Um. Okay. Moving on. Did nobody want the ashtray? I don't think. <laughs> oh lordy! I gotta sell some things today. Misty's gonna get mad. Misty's gonna be like Michelle. Oh, I do have a shiv. You got that right. She saw my shiv when I met Cindy. I had my shiv. I'll burn my shiv if I have to. Okay, you guys. Are you ready for this? Yep. Bob Ross. Playing cards. Sealed in the package. Amazing. <laughs> all right. We all remember Bob Ross. I mean, Shelly. Okay, I, you got it. Shelly, um, I, I, I thought Misty told me that you were in the hospital and I had um, sent you an invoice and I was like, oh, no wonder she hasn't, you know, because I didn't know and I hope you're all right. I, mean, I didn't know anything about it. I'm, I'm, I'm hoping because you're here that you're all right. Yeah. Oh, what? What? You're wearing a Bob Ross t-shirt right now, Polly? That's freaking hilarious. Oh my gosh. Ah, oh, <laughs> that's hilarious. Oh, well, Jane, where do you live? Hey, girl. How's my carry girl? Home from the doctor. Oh, no. Oh, Okay, well, oh, as long as you're okay, Shelly, that's the most important. I'm pixelated. That's not good. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, anyhow, this is only $8. Oh, okay, good. $8, number 46. $8, number 46. Bree, I don't know how close to see now. I'm going to have to Google. Sometimes I do that. 
I have Googled. You got it, Polly. And I'm going to put it in with uh, your what you got the other day. <laughs> I love my people. I just love you guys. All right, this next item is just a little... Uh, I, I, it's a lot, but it's only three things. Because they're tiny. And I was like... Yeah, now. So let me just show you. It's this little this little mushroom. Okay. Oh yeah. Uh trust me, that's not far from me since I'm in Wisconsin. So here's this little mushroom. And it's got a frog, I guess I, I would call it a toadstool. On there, there it is. He's got some spots on, like, so he's a spotted toad. I don't know. And flowers. So it's just this little, little shroom, right? Yeah. Hey, Jen. Yeah, there's a little tiny frog on here. Do you see it? It would actually go with some miniature tanalas. <laughs> it's cute. Then there's this little bell. And it kind of gives me the feeling of like a honey or a honey, um, not honey. What am I trying to say? A beehive? A little bit. But it's just a tiny, again, this one's not really made to like make some good noise because it's just tiny. It's just cute. Cute little beehive bell. Right? So again, just two cute things. And then this one, you can hang this on a string or a twine or whatever. You can put it outside, you can put it inside, you can put it wherever you want. Uh-huh. So, there's these three things. That's going to be $10, and it's number 22. $10 for the lot, number 22. Jen, you got it. All right, let me lip up. This next item is going to be an offer up. Starting at 15. And I have a vase somewhere. It'll probably have to be in the sale in two weeks, I think. This is a little something different. This is Tanala-esque. There you go. And it's blue. Okay? It's footed also. Isn't that neat? And it's a star. And it's cool the way it's like got that. And then it's got the butterfly and the bird inside. And it's a dish. If you want it to be. Or you can prop it up. However... Or you can just have it flat wherever. It's just very cool. It's got some crazing inside. Or on, on it. I should say it's inside, outside, whatever. So I'll bring it up close so you can see the crazing. It's really cute, right? And I have, I know I have a, a vase to go with it somewhere. Not to go. Well, I didn't get them together, but they go together. That's for sure. See, so you can see some of that crazing. Anyhow, so it's starting at $15. I don't know if anybody offered up yet. Yeah, I think the lag is real today. So it's going to be starting at $15. Got Pamela at $15. Sue at $16. Precious, hi! Precious was at 18. I got Pamela at a 20. Julian thrifting, not high enough. Elaine is going for it. She said 25. She's bidding like she wants it. Yeah, girl. So we got Elaine Linney at 25. Got Pamela at 29. Oh, Joanne made a jump, but she just didn't jump quite high enough. Pamela is at 29. <laughs> oh, hey, Sarah Lee. 
Elaine is at 30. Diana's out. Precious is at 32. Pamela's at 35. Elaine is out. So I have Pamela at 35. I have to see, is Sue still in? Is Precious still in? Sue is out. Hello. Precious is at 38. Precious is at 38. Now we'll see what Pamela responds. Pamela is out. Got Precious Lavender Buttons at 38. I believe everybody else was out. So I am calling it at Precious Lavender Buttons at 38. Thank you so much, Joanne. Oh, darn it, this thing. 38. Thank you so much, Joanne. All right, next up I have a beautiful, oh no, I'm going to do this next. I'm sorry. Next up I have a super cool bottle. Um, it's made in Italy. Uh, made in Italy. There you go. It's made in Italy. And um, it this would be the kind that would look so cool with uh, a candle on here melted some, you know, super cool. So it's got like the, um, I guess this is like that raffia. I think that's what that is. Yeah. Chianti. <laughs> yeah. So, um, it, it's just a super cool. And again, this would be super cool with like, I mean, yes, I, like I said, I, I think it would be so cool with, a candle and all that globbing on but it would also be super cool with feathers or pompous grass or whatever so this is going to be ten dollars and it is number 17 ten dollars number 17 Oh, hi, Julie. I'm sorry to hear that. All right, so $10 to number 17. I'm going to put this aside, and we are going to get on to, oh, this. Um, this is just, I don't know. I just thought it was cute, and I thought I'll throw this in the boho sale. Because <laughs> boho people are a little quirky sometimes, and I thought it was funny. It says, I don't like morning people or mornings or people. <laughs> so this is just a, a you know a nice hand towel it's brand new it's um i don't think it has any tags on it i might have torn tags off if there were but it's brand new nice little kitchen towel it's eight dollars where's the thing eight dollars and it's number one eight dollars number one Vintage Digs, you got it. What's your name again? Um, is it Gina? Yeah, I 
that so. All right. I'm going to need your information, so make sure you email it to me. ComfyCozyLiving at gmail.com. Thank you. All right. Next up, I don't know if Belinda Carroll is still here. <laughs> but um, this next piece is made by Hallmark Cards. And it is quite a bit different than your usual things. So, thank you, Katie. I believe it to be a paperweight, okay? The back of it is felted. It does have your Hallmark sticker on it. Also has a piece of my hair somewhere. There we go. Okay. It's got this pretty little nature scene. And then you're all like, but Michelle, it has a hole in it. Mm -hmm, because it's a paper weight that will also hold your pen. How convenient is that? It is form and function and function. So it's like form and function times two. Because it's holding down your papers and it's holding your pen. How awesome is that? Well, I don't know if, if uh, Belinda is here, but anyhow. It's $15 and it's number 36. $15, number 36. You just snorted laughed about what? Was it something I said? <laughs> Man, this leg. Oh, form and function. Well, you know, you gotta make it, like, multifunctional. Hey, girl, hey! Oh, I'm good. Did you get my package? I'm so bad. I'm so bad. Right? I have no shame for a snort laugh. Please, this system of mine right here, I'm just lucky if I snort laugh and nothing comes out. That's what, you know. Um, well, pretty, did you get my package yet? And you don't have to video it. You did. Okay. You don't have to video it because I'm like way late on that, like months. <laughs> but anyway. Okay. So this is an Avon calling. What? This had roses, roses in it. I haven't... But it is just, I, I'm trying to look in the light. It's so dark that it's not even like giving me like any kind of clearness. It looks like it was like maybe a greenish brownish bottle, but it's pretty like cult. It's pretty saturated on the whatever. Yes, Avon girl. Yes. Anyhow, it's beautiful. Look at how springy it is. It's got a little butterfly. And some flowers. And again, this would be great with like your, you know, dried flowers. This is my stand-in for dried flowers. A little dried flower or a, um, you know, some, again, pompous grass, whatever. You, you know, but I think this would be cute for like, or like a few daisies. You know, real daisies. You can put some water in here. This is fine to use for that regular vase, you know. Oh, you're so sweet. Anyway, this is $10 and it's number 41. $10, number 41. It's so pretty. Mary Jo Vakovsky, thank you. I always think of you in that apron. <laughs> I saw one the other day that was similar. It was kind of weird. And I thought of you. <laughs> um, all right. Next up, I have this little dog. Now, somebody said it, it's Onyx. I thought Onyx is only black. And so I thought is maybe some kind of, um, not marble. Quartz? No. I don't know. Is it onyx, though? Can it be onyx if it's white? I don't know. I'm a dork. But I just thought it was cute. Right? It's so cute. Little doggy.
stone. Yeah, some kind of stone. Quartz crystal. Hi, Melinda. Yeah. So it's going to be $8 and it's number 19. $8, number 19. Man, I wish the lag wasn't so bad today. I don't know why it is. Either that or people just aren't interested. Yeah, that's possible. Oof, 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 oof. He's looking up like he wants a treat. Nobody? All right, I got these two boxes that are super cool. 19 Purple Girl, you got it. You got the dog. Okay, I got this. First one is, it's hinged, and it's got velvet on the inside. It's pink Incole, um, Incole stone. I don't know what that necessarily is, but that's a pink color, very like muted. Let's see. Then the bottom is flat, but it's got the little pads. So this is $12 and it's number 50. $12, number 50. And then I have this one, somewhat similar, and it's a uh, Design Gifts International. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, you got it, Cat. You got it. And then this one. So this one, this comes. And this is a little different. It's this one's a lighter, like more vibrant kind of pink with this rose on the cover. And this one is eight dollars, and it's number thirty. Eight dollars, number thirty. Which, um, it was the regular price whenever it was bought, too. <laughs> Who knew? <sighs> oh, never late. I got plenty, you know. Plenty more to go. Plenty, plenty more to go. All right, I am, uh, let's see here. Do I have this? Right. Okay, I'm gonna do an offer up. Uh, Blind by Beauty, hey Brittany, you got it. You got it, girl. Thank you. Um, I'm going to do an offer up on this book, starting it at $15. First of all, just look at it. It's super cool. If you saw me do this in the, in the hall, you will know this is quite the interesting book. First of all, it's got great graphics on the front and back. It's called The Garden of Goodness, Samplings from the Garden of Goodness, a collection of recipes from Heartland America. We're going to start the offers at $15. And this is one of those with all the different, oh, and they're good, people. They're good. You got appetizers and hors d'oeuvres, broiled grapefruit. It's grapefruit, brown sugar, and one teaspoon of butter and grilled chicken liver. Antipasto, curried olive canapes. I mean, there's some good stuff still in here. Shrimp dip. Then you got beverages. 
Yeah, we're doing this starting at fifteen dollars. Fifteen, if you're in, interested. Okay, I did remember reading this in the, and I'm gonna read this one again. This is a beverage. It's called the Cherry Bounce, and it's it requires one quart of cherries, one quart of vodka, and one cup of sugar. And you have to prick each cherry several times. Mix together. Let's stand at least four months. Four months. What? You may use other fruits such as strawberries or raspberries. A delicious after dinner cordial. Uh, should I continue or is anybody interested in this? It's starting at $15. Oh, K uh, Katie, there's, okay, desserts and sweets. They had amazing, they got lemon bars, Amish. Look, somebody needs to make me some caramel corn. Mm. White fruit cake, rich cake, coon cake. I don't want to know. But let me just tell you. There was okay. Here we go. Ice box lemon pie. Yum. Um. There was. There were. Soda cracker cake. Pies. I know four months, right? Luncheon dishes. Um, and this is like a lot of good food: corn pie, baked beans, dinner in a dish. It's 1978. Six. 1976. I'm sorry. I wrote 78. Six. 1976. It's so good. Um, but I'm trying to find chicken, a cheeseburger, tetrazzini, tamale pie. There were, I'm, I'm trying to find it, eat ham and broccoli royal. Mm. I don't know about that. Drunken pork chops. Those did sound good. I remember. I'm trying to find the... Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I got to go back to the... Um, then they have what they call... Where did they call it? Quick breads, yeast breads, and coffee cakes. And those all sound good, too. But then you got your, um, then you got your salads. Here we go. Here we go, uh, Katie. There's, a. Uh, this one's so disgusting to me. Asparagus salad. Two envelopes of unflavored gelatin. A half a cup of cold water. One can undiluted asparagus soup. There's where you lose me right there. A, a half a cup of mayonnaise. I don't know. They call it three ounce packages of cream cheese, but I don't know. Maybe back then. Yeah, right. Cream cheese, grated onion, stuffed olives, chopped celery, and then um, canned asparagus pieces like why not like some fresh <laughs> asparagus but anyhow and then yeah then you're soaking the gelatin in water heat the soup to boiling add the gelatin and cool mix the mayonnaise and cream cheese together then add all remaining ingredients to the gelatin mixture pour into a large mold and chill <laughs> right oh just the idea of that Asparagus soup, <laughs> uh, right? The blueberry salad doesn't sound so bad. I'm not sure. I don't know. Some of these things they ask for odd things in it, but I mean, some of them are good. Okay, here's the other one that was just like, what? It's Christine Wagner's salad. This was, and this was sent by, sent in by May Wagner Stoltz, well, probably a sister or something. This has, hi, Jackie. Um, and right off the bat, I'm like, yuck. Uh, tomato juice. Right? Me either. 
tomato juice, lemon gelatin. I'm okay with that. Small curd cottage cheese. Yeah, it's one of these books. Um, celery diced. Pimento olives diced. Green pepper diced. Ew. Onion diced. And mayonnaise. Heat the tomato juice and the gel lemon gelatin. Cool. When partially congealed, <laughs> add other ingredients. Place in large mold and chill. This salad holds very well in hot weather. <laughs> She's from Illinois, so she would know hot, one, hot summers, right? Yeah, so I was just like, say what now? <laughs> um, yeah, there's all kinds of stuff in here. And then there's salad dressings and stuff. So, there's a sauerkraut salad, yeah, the, a tuna potato puff. There's a mall, There are tons of recipes in here. So nobody bid. Did I not see any single bids? I know. It was too fun to read, though. Ooh, that sounds really good. Hamburger barley soup. Yum. Okay, I don't see anybody bidding on this. Oh, there. Okay, so Jen is at 15. Jen's at 15. Diane is at 15. So, Jen, you're at 15. Is anybody going higher than 15? Diane's at 16. Diane is at 16. Let Diane have it. All right. We're just going to go with that. Diane McIntosh for $16. That'll work. That'll work. I know, and it's on the back, too. So good. The book itself is great. All right. Next, I have this cool box. Cool box. Where's my box? There we go. It is this kind of like a green, um, it's a, like a olivey green. Can you guys kind of get it from here? I'm trying to get it close so you can see the design on it. And so it's got these little toggle things to, to latch in, okay? And then, bam, it is blue. Very turquoisey, very turquoisey, and I don't know who if somebody like tried to do this. It's got like its own little separate section over here, maybe for your special ring or something. You can use this for jewelry or whatever. This is like somebody put foam in here. Yeah, it's really cool, and it's got that like thicker like fiber paperboard whatever. I don't know feels like, but. It's a nice box. I just think it's so cool. You could keep whatever in it. Like, I mean, you could put, you could use this for jewelry and put like pins and stuff in here. Or you do whatever you want to do. We know what all the things you can put in a box, right? But I also like the way it latches. This is going to be $15 and it's number six. $15, number six. Look how cool that is. And this is a great, like, put something on top of it. You got it, Cara, 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 Cara. Uh, all right. All right, this next thing is going to be an offer up as well. Aw, oh, thanks, Cindy. Okay, this next, this is going to be an offer up because... It's just something different. 
and it's made by JLM. So I don't know if this is like a studio piece or what, because this is so beautiful and different. Um, so it's going to be starting at ten dollars. I'm going to start at ten dollars. It's about um, eleven at its largest. It's about eleven to just under eight. So let's call it eight by eleven. Look at the shape on this. It's gorgeous. The back is not glazed, okay? Well, it's glazed to like right here. It goes around the lip. But look at that beautiful design. It's uh oh, it's like in there. It's so beautiful. Yeah, it is. I don't I don't know what it is. See, I don't know if it's like a studio piece or just a hobbyist piece. I don't know. That's why I'm doing an offer on it. So it's starting at $10. It's, this is just really pale, a little blue, a little pink, a little yellow, but not, not anything like popping with color. But I just, I mean, the shape of it, it's like, I mean, definitely you could, I would say you could use it as a serving dish, but I don't know. I mean, it's so pretty. It's like, get a plate wrap and just, it's just gorgeous, right? Yeah, it's, the colors are subtle, but the design is beautiful, right? You see that? There you can kind of see that it like goes into the plate. I just think it's beautiful. I, I love the shape of it. Now I'll tell you the honest truth. If that was a round plate or platter, oval platter with that design, I would say, oh, it's a pretty design. We got Sugar Bridges is bidding at $10. If anybody um, wants it, it yeah, <laughs> all right. Uh, we got $10, so 11 or more would uh, be the next offer. Um, but it's the shape that got my attention. I mean, it's just, it's so cool. And there's no chips or cracks, which, you know, and it's got that kind of like very subtle speckling also. You can, I don't know, look, I'm going to try to get closer if you can see that. But it's so good. It's just so good. And it's so, it, it's like I said, it's it's glazed to like there. You can see that line of, so this bottom part is not, okay? But the initials are JLM, and that's it. That's the initials. That's it. It's just so pretty. All right, well, I'm going to go with uh, Sugar Britches on this for $10. You got it, Sugar Britches. <laughs> I'm trying to think of something for you right now, but I can't. My brain is like, let me think, let me think, let me think. I'll be thinking. <laughs> oh, um, okay, this is the next item. It's so good. This can be, now it's a scarf, but you can use this as a table runner also. Look at these colors. Look at that. Ah, these are the best colors. And you got your fringe. You know I like me having the fringe. Yes, look at that. And the fringe. I love these colors. I love them. <laughs> it says I collect I get I collect junk. <laughs> Oops. Um yeah. <laughs> I just love this thing. I just love it. And I guess I mean I should show you, you know, obviously you guys can use it as a scarf. Really cute. Like with a t-shirt or something, a jack, jean jacket, you know, just a little something. Or, you know, you can always just go like that. You can also go like that. Okay. Um, or you could do this. If you have a, a scarf clip, I, I have one I should use to show you. You, you stick that in, you pull that up, you put it wherever you want. You can bring it all the way up. You can put it down here. And you um, clip it in and you got, you can use a brooch too in the same way and do that. Or you know what else you could do? I know you guys are going to, somebody's going to buy this and my DNA will be all over it. But you could do this too. And you can, um, 
you can tie it down here or if your head's not as big as mine you could probably bring it up one more time but um yeah so there you could do that or you can do what I like to do is you know my bun and then I um, I wrap it around my bun a few times so yeah but this also I think this one would be amazing as a table scarf I also have one that you know like target oh, there we go um a lamp you know if you have a floor lamp floor lamp sometimes there's like a little like outward part I have one um that I got tied on to one of my lamps so anyhow it's uh going to be $12 and it's number 28 Twelve dollars, number twenty-eight. You got it, Jen. Um, you guys. Okay, quick note on that. I uh, I love this because, um, if you were a fan of Friends and Katie, I've talked. I've said this before. Katie's like Michelle. I know this story already, but I'm gonna tell it again and again and again and again. Always. Um, when, um, I think it was, uh, Chandler and Joey, they were looking for something, I think, and they opened, well, there was this door and they were like, what's in this door? And Chandler's like, I don't know. Monica just always said, don't go in there. So I don't. Well, they open it and it is a ton of junk. Like, you know how Monica's like this clean freak, but then it turns out she has all this crap that she just puts in that closet. So when, uh, when, when Monica comes home and they're like, you know, <laughs> no, you're going to, we're going to have to get together, girl. That's what we need to do. I got your stuff in a box right under here. No worries. Um, then. When Monica comes home, you know, Chandler's like all ready to, you know, because he can't wait to say something, right? So all of a sudden, they open the door and she's like, uh, like she knows she's busted. And he's like, that's my, one of my favorite episodes or like parts of an episode anyway. I just thought it was hilarious. <laughs> so, all right. <laughs> um, next I have just a simple little basket. I do not always like to have a ton of baskets, but if I find a nice, well-made one, especially if it's not too big, I'm going to grab it. And this one's made really well. It's very sturdy. Again, a great key catcher. You yeah, throw your packs of gum in here and then grab a pack of gum when you want a pack of gum. Um, you know, change the, your jewelry, whatever, you know, like, um, you could put, um, um, like, you know, some of your wax melts or something to, so they're accessible to you, whatever. Anyhow, it's very small. Well, not very small. You know, it's a little bigger in my hand. It's $6 and it's number 18, $6. Number 18. See, it's really well made, though. Yeah, I think it's really good. I like it. All right. Next up. Beautiful USA 3370 for whatever that matters if anybody got the marks from being on the up while it's been glazed so beautifully. Look at this. Now, I mean, I could state the obvious green and gold comments, but I won't. It's got crazing. Look at that. Lots of crazing. It's got this beautiful glaze, like a drip glaze. Okay. 
so pretty. Again, whatever you want to put in there. Otherwise, it's just gorgeous, just like this also. This is going to be $15, and it's number 12. $15, number 12. All right, next up is this super cool Mexican leather, like, coin wallet thing. Cool little flowers on both sides. Really nicely done. Then you open this up, and over here you have your little... You know, I sent her a message telling her, don't forget I'm on... <sighs> I know, right? Is anybody hello? <laughs> so you can put your coins in here if you want to. I just think it's cute if you collect stuff like this. This is a cute piece to add to your collection or just to a vignette. It's super beautiful. It is $12 and it's number 44. $12, number 44. Joanne, is this what you want? No, uh, number 44? Did you, you you said 24. Did you mean 44? Yep. Okay, you got it. Thank you. All right, this next item. I don't know. Maybe I should save it for next week. I don't know. Maybe I will save this for next week for my sale. Because this is gorgeous. And... Is anybody interested in something like this? It would be an offer up. It's a leather pencil case. I don't know if anybody saw the leather wallet I had yes, uh, the other day. Is anybody interested in something like this? It's from uh, Honolulu. I think I'm going to hold off on that piece. Okay, I have got this set of baskets. These are so good. And they nest into one another. They're so good. So this is um, Anhui Handicrafts, made in the People's Republic of China. They are so good. Look at this. And I love, I love the way they're like rounded at the top here. They are, you know, a little squishy. See, they're like a double basket, like a basket within a basket. Do you see what I'm saying? The way it's woven. Like, so it's like two layers and there's like a, oh, can you see that? Like, it's so cool. And then you get your, ne your next size. And these are great for plants. Like you can see there must have been a plant in here. These are great for plants. And they keep it like cohesive. If you have three different sized plants and you use these for all of them. And then for shipping, hello, simple. Yes. So these are great. And these are going to be for the set. It's 25 and they're 33. Number 33. For $25, number 33. Set of three pen uh, baskets, pencils, I was going to say. They're just so good. Shannon, girl, you got them. Shannon, did you get the other ones that I had? The three different colored ones? I don't think it was you. I can't remember. Okay. 
Oh, okay. No, I mean like on a previous sale. I had like three that were like that, but they were three different colors. So, okay. I don't know if my girl is here. Is Blue Flamingo Lori here? She's going to be mad if she misses these. Are you guys ready? <laughs> We're going to start the offers at 20 on these. They are, again, I, look, I don't know, these fish find me. And I don't even buy all the fish things I'm finding. I try to stick with what I know you guys really like. And these, I think some people are really going to like. First of all, the colors are fantastic. Secondly, the design is amazing. Look at that. This is like, oh, look at that. So good. And then you got your turquoise fin and then the little, or scale, I don't know, fin. Yeah, I don't know. Anyhow, awesome, right? Then look at this design. Oh, so good. So I don't know, because there's like, like, I don't know, like, Something in that was on here that made it look like they... Because there's also holes at the bottom. 20. Okay, so you're starting the bid at 20. Precious is starting the offer at $20. So you can... Um, there's holes on the bottom. So I was like, I wonder if there, if there was like more of these. If they were like, you know, hung. On something. I don't know. They are coconut shells, I do believe. Do you see on the inside? Now, I'm not saying you'd use these for like one of your um, wash, you know, like a scrubbing little thing. I don't think that's what you would use this for. I really don't know other than it's so, 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 so cute. Um, I mean, like you could have candy in here, like wrapped candy. You know what I mean? Yeah, you could definitely use some air plants or something in here. But they're great, aren't they? They're just so good. And they got that big old... Nobody's at... I just don't have the right people. Oh, I know. I know where some people are going, but... um. Okay, well, I'm just going to go with $20, Joanne. It's your lucky day. Joanne, you got them. $20. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Next. Next up is oh uh, I just uh, I just love this it's one it's not genuine but it totally no I'm not selling that that's mine to keep <laughs> yes those other fish you got are awesome too no um Shannon that's mine sorry um this is one of those Zach designs it's like a reproduction, but look how cute. It looks like one of those barf bowls, you know, like Texas wear or something. And also this one is like, um, there was just a little <clears throat> something in there. Now I hope I didn't swallow it. It was like dusty. Um, it's, do you see how it's like kind of oblong-ish instead of totally round? So I don't know if this is like good for toothbrushes or what, but in my opinion, it's super mid-century, but it's also, I mean, like, look, anything with all this color is so boho. This is great. I just thought, do whatever you want. This would be good for your little fresh flowers that you grab out of the yard, something different. That's how I like to do, you know? Anyhow, this is going to be $10, number 49. $10, number 49. It'd be good for a kid's bathroom because it's not going to break. And put their toothbrushes in it. And it's a cute color that kids would like, boys or girls. It's just neat. 
it's just neat. That's all. Mm, okay, moving on. Moving on. Um, okay, let's do this table covering. It's really pretty. It looks like a denim blue, like a dark denim blue and a light denim blue. Hey, Maury. And then it has this beautiful fuchsia, which I love. So I also it has on the two opposite corners, this fringe. Now, not on the two opposite corners, on both, of, on all of the corners. So let me try to, I don't know, I'm going to try to measure this. It will probably be impossible because I don't have that little thing like I usually do. That's like 18 and 18 and 18. Oh, the measurements are on here. It's Opal House. It's 57 by 57. <laughs> it's by Opal House. That's why it's so cool. 57 by 57. Look at this. This is awesome. I think it's like good for like a um like a card table. Or you know, a, a small kitchen table. Whatever. Oh, I love it. Love it. Oh my gosh, I love this so much. Okay. Here we go. <clears throat> and it has that fringe on all the corners. It's just so cool. And it's very light and very thin. Like, look, this, if this is all you bought, I could put it in a envelope easily. Um, this is, and if not, it's still, you know, um, this is going to be $15 and it's 42, number 42, $15. That's a pretty good price. $15, number 42. $15, number 42. Oh, people, I feel like everybody's like gone to sleep or something. <laughs> I know everybody's not into the, you got it, Shannon. I know. Hi, June, how are you? Oh, I just love you, June. How are you doing? How are you and your sweet son? Um, okay, Shannon, you got it. I gotcha. I gotcha. All right. Next up. Tell you, there's another thing I forgot to write down. How's about a piece of Home Co? Um, it's a Home Co wall pocket, like, planter. I mean, you know. Oh, yeah, he is awesome. Um... It's, it, it, you could put like a piece of foam down there and then, you know, a regular, like a fake or whatever plant, uh, um, greens you want to use, or you can put, you know, something that drapes out. You could, I think, put real, but do you, okay? Be careful. Read it. There's two little hooks to put it on the wall. Oh, it's, um, measures. 
10 and a quarter by about five and a quarter. And it's gonna be $15 and it's number five. This is a good one. This is really super cool. $15, number five. <laughs> Take this out because I forgot about it. Lori, you got it. Oh, it worked it. It does look like wicker. Oh, that's all right. Oh, no, okay. No problem. No problem. All right. Um, well, I got this in front of me. I'm going to do this. This is one of those body pillow um, cases, which I had a body pillow. I still do, but Bella broke it to it. I can't have pillows. I can't have pillows. This is so good. It says nature. It says green is my favorite color. It says plant, bike fuel, every drop counts. Love your mother. Think green. Hug me. Conserve water. Uh, peace. Save the planet. Conserve water. Every drop counts. Think green. Love your mother. Hug me. Green is my favorite color. Peace. Reduce, reuse, recycle, and it has some birds. It has a, a cute whale. It has mushrooms. It has peace signs. It has a bike. I love this thing. So cool. And, you know, it says love your mother, Mother Earth, you know. It has an owl. It says I love nature. Super cute. And it's, um, I don't know if it's that microfiber because it feels like um, somewhat flannel-y, but it's not flannel. Do you know what I mean? I think it's that microfiber. I don't remember. Anyway, it's going to be $15 and it's number 21 for the body pillow case. $15, number 21. Lesta, you got it, Lesta. How are you? All right. I'm going to do this next thing since it's right in front of me because I forgot to write it down as well. And it is made in the Philippines. Um, and it's this pretty tray. I, oh, wait, wait, wait. I know it was. My numbers. All right. And, okay. So it's uh, made in the Philippines. It's this Kamani wood. There you go. Really nice. Um, again, this would be, this is really super cool for like your mid-century or, you know, like if you like a modern bohemian, like, you know, slash mid-century, this would be great. Um, this would be really nice, like on a, on a dresser where you, you know, like take and you can put your wallet or your husband could, whatever, wallet, keys, change, um, you know, rings, uh, earrings, bracelets, whatever. This is, again, one of those great things. Or, you know, me, um, Skittles, m m nuts, whatever. <laughs> so this is going to be $15 and it's number 34. $15, number 34. Um, yeah, it's uh, made in the Philippines, and it's Kamani wood. You got it, Shannon. All 
All right. Next is, <laughs> like, I'm like, which way does it hang from? This cruel, I think that's cruel. Is that cruel? Um, hanging. <laughs> it is long. <laughs> Let me see how long it is. 18, 36, uh, 42, 43-ish, 42, 48, 42 and a half, something like that. I don't know. Um, but, and that does not include this. So here's the thing. <laughs> I mean, this is meant to be the top, I'm pretty sure, because you hang it like this. Okay? Because the bottom has this little dowel in it to hold it, like, down. It's very long. <laughs> See? So you got a little little tassel action. <laughs> and it's really pretty, isn't it? It's very long. <laughs> so anyhow, it is very long. It is uh, $22. And it's number 47. It's $22 and it's number 47. Oh, Shannon, you got it. <laughs> Nanette, sorry. Nanette, you're just like what right behind. All right. Shannon's on fire today. Hey, Laura. Okay, the next item is <laughs> it's just somebody will like this. It's this little, I don't know, I'm calling it a gnome box. Um it's see <coughs> you guys know I love a mushroom. <laughs> yeah, it's got a face, too. Look at the mushroom and the gnome. He's taking a little break, and then he's feeding his bird friends. And this box, it's the lid for something, I guess. I don't know. To me, it would be a cool riser. You put a little something up there. I don't know. It's just cute for somebody, right? There he is with his hat on with his bird friend. And then here he is, hat off again, feeding the... Which I guess this is a sick bird because it looks like he's feeding the sick bird his some soup. See how the bird has like the little thing over the little kerchief around his mouth like as if he had a toothache. <laughs> so I just think it's funny. He's sitting there feeding the birds. I don't know. He's cute. Right? There he is with his hat. So yeah, it's just different. It's different, but like we always like different. And if you see something different, you buy it. Right? So this is $15 and it is number 29. $15 and it's number 29. You got it, Shannon. <laughs> All right. This next item is, it's like, I guess, got this Greek key design. It is plastic. It's, I would, I'm trying to find the, a, a company name. It's like Homeco or Sirocco or Burwood. It's one of these. See, it's just this, you know, good plastic. It's not bending. 
it would be an excellent like candle tray you could put put candles on it um you could put um just like a collection on here would be a great way to showcase a collection of something if you have you know things several of something that you would like to put together it'd be nice it's very lightweight i will say how long it is though um it is 16 inches long and it's six almost six and a half wide so it's 16 inches long and it's just this it's like a wooden you know it's that faux wood you know color whatever So this is going to be $15, and it is number 38. $15, number 38. And it's just like the, I mean, it's not the same color. See, it's not the same color, but it's like that natural, you know, kind of naturalish, you know, like wood, tree, whatever color. So $15, number 38. Okay, next I have these swans. Now, normally I wouldn't have swans in this one, but the colors made it like, I mean, boba people like their swans too. This was originally a three-piece set. <clears throat> I only found two pieces. They are Inesco made in Japan. Um, this one is cracked on the bottom. But I don't see that that is a factor in anything because it doesn't go through any further. So it seems to be fine. They are um, lovely. The colors. That still has the sticker that says three-piece swan console set, even though it's two. But um, And then the color, it's like the color didn't quite cover right there. But that's manufacturing. I mean, this this just has a couple little like chips on the base there, and um, that's it. So this one is wide open in the in there. So I don't know like if that would be for like a plant or um, how you would want what you would want to put in there. But then this one has like a candlestick holder looking thing, or you know a fake or an air plant, a rig one, whichever. You do you, boo. So um, the two of these, and the, the thing is that it's this black and this turquoise, and I don't know if you can see those colors kind of running in there. It's so pretty that they're not your typical colors, you know? Um, so this is going to be, for the pair, $15, and it's number 35. $15, number 35. Mama and baby. Mama and baby. All right, Elaine, you got them. Elaine, I am pretty sure you sent me your information. I'm pretty sure you did. If you didn't, though, please do to um, comfycozyliving at gmail.com. Okay. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Next up, I am going to... I don't have too much left. Now, I'm, I'm going to end with a, with a big one, with the offer up. So this next item, I just love this thing. So cool. And it's really lightweight. Okay, I thought you did. It's really lightweight. It doesn't have any kind of markings. I I really don't know what it is. But um, so it's like this wood striation and it's so lightweight. I don't know. I mean, it's so cool. It's so I, I believe it has to be. It's not this is not plastic. It might be like wood that's been like shellacked or whatever the word is nowadays. 
Um, but it's got to be some kind of wood. It, it's just so good, right? It's so good. Oh, yeah, we had that snow crap yesterday, and today it's beautiful again. Although, you know, the temp is, you know, we're climbing, though. See, on the inside, it's like that, too. No, it's not cork, though. Uh-uh. But isn't this just cool? I think it, it, first of all, I think it looks cool the way it is. I love this handle. Look at that. It's like a chunky handle. It's a chunky, like, jug or pitcher or vase or whatever. I think a big old bunch of flower, like fake or dried flowers, a big old, like a big old bunch chunked in there would look so good. And it's, oh, it's all right. I know you got your meeting, Joelle. So I just think, I don't know, it's just so good. And it's so lightweight. And it's, um, it's like seven inches or just above seven inches at the lip. Tall. It's just so good. And I, like I said, it's very lightweight. It's, excuse me, $20 and it's number three. $20, number three. Look at this. I mean, it's just. I can't believe that there's not a maker's mark on here. I feel like it's special. I don't, I mean, I don't know. Just look at the handle and stuff. It's just, I love like stuff that looks very natural, rustic and stuff. So I feel like there's just something so cool about that. Just like all the little different kind of striations in the wood or whatever. I love it. Okay, moving on. I think this will be the last item on the regular round. This is going to be an offer up. And it is going to start at $25. It is Bar Harbor Pottery of Maine. Okay, you can Google this right now. And this piece right here is $45. One just like this. Uh, so we're going to start at $25. And I had I had uh, subscriber friends even telling me, Michelle, that's valuable. Check it out, yada, yada. So anyhow, this is a beautiful piece. You see it's as big as my hand about, you know, it's, let's see, give you a height. It's like, yeah, I'm not quite, it's like four and a half inches tall. It's just gorgeous. This gorgeous turquoise with this beautiful, like, green drip with this cobalt, like, in it, in that color. This looks like a D handle if you're going to, you know, if you would use, like, that kind of. Andrea is starting at 25. Bar Harbor is 44 hours from you. See? Yeah, so you know about this. <laughs> me and you both, Jen. Yeah, so this is just a gorgeous piece. So you know all about that, then, um, kitschy. Kitschy, kitschy. Right? I mean, I don't remember who told me about it, but... So it's right here. Bar Harbor Pottery, Maine. And like I said, this piece is the one of them that I found online. And it's it's just gorgeous. And you know what? This I will say, even that even that that I, even this to me you don't even have to put anything in there. It's just so pretty. You know what I mean? Like you want to look at this. This is art. This is art. I mean, obviously you know, but I mean, like sometimes, you know, it, you know, they say beauty is in the eye of the beholder and it's absolutely true because some people are like, you know, why do you have all of these da, 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 da. And I'm like, cause I, my eyes find them beautiful. I like to look at something like that. I did, right? Like all the different things with handles, right? Isn't there something about that? I love things with handles. I don't know what it is. So 
Yeah, this is, I mean, I thought there'd be more interest in this. Yeah, and that, that's just the thing. It's like, Jen, right? Like, if somebody said something, I'd be like, uh, who lives with my stuff, me or you? You know? It's nice to get, a, it's nice to get complimented on your stuff because, you know, that's always the, you know, feel good kind of moment. But if somebody doesn't like your stuff, that's okay too because you're the one that lives with it. It makes you happy. It brings you joy, right? So I forgot who had this <laughs> 25. Andrea Kane, I'm sorry. Well, Andrea, you might be getting a really good deal here. Um, yeah, I don't know enough about it, Tammy, except for that I it's very lightweight. It's really cool. It's got this weird chunky handle. It's very, like I said, very lightweight. I just love it so much. Yeah, and this one's 20, I think. Was it? Yeah, this is 20. And it's no, no markings. This one's at 25. And Andrea, I, I don't know what olive wood is, but that might be what it is because it seems like something I've never seen before and it's really cool but andrea i think you're gonna be getting the deal of the day tammy okay i'll put you down for that picture it's twenty dollars andrea kane you just got the deal of the day twenty five dollars you got it girl i'm calling it I, I'm not going to draw it out to make more money. Oh, well. You got a great deal. Um, okay. Is everybody going to hang in there so we can go through everything that didn't sell? Everybody, Anybody interested in round two? I got it. I got her already down kitschy. Thank you. I'm all about round two because everybody's not always here for round one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So this item, you guys, this one is a Wisconsin piece. It's O'Keen Pottery. Let's do it. That's right. Yeah, Nanette, you didn't get anything yet today, girl. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, okay. You guys want a bonus item before I start round two? Oh, I forgot about this. Bonus item. Oh, hang on. <laughs> no. Sure. Okay. Oh, I love it. Look at it. So if you wanted to, you can put a light through here, a, a bulb. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm going to do, I'll do an offer up because I don't know. So let's uh, let's do an offer up, and and I'll just start it at fifteen. Isn't that neat? Pink, it's plastic, so nothing that's breakable. Oh, I just know. Let me just tell you from the capiz shells that I have hanging up there in the light. Oh, there's nothing that brings me more like peace and serenity than when I look up there at the beauty of it all. Okay, so Bree's at twenty. Oh, Nanette's at twenty. Brie was at 15. I'm sorry. And then that's at 20. Hi, Kim. It's so awesome. And it's got everything you need right here. And like I said, you can put, you can feed a light through there if you want to. Otherwise, if you don't, you just hang it up. It's super cool. Very lightweight. And it like just, it just all like 
folds up basically, <laughs> you know. Real retro. Yeah, it's super, it's super cool. So we got Nanette at 20. Got Nanette at 20. Okay, I got nobody else, so I'm going to go with Nanette at 20. And you got it. All right. Well, that worked out. <laughs> um. Oh, I just love that thing. It's very cool. Okay, back to the beginning. Okay, so this Okeen, Okeen pottery piece. I don't know, you might have had a chance to look it up while I was doing that. Okeen pottery. It's in Wisconsin. And I wasn't able to figure this out for a while. And then last night I looked and it's for either soap or lotion. And you can buy the attachment on their website, Okeen pottery. So, um, yeah, it. And it, look how beautiful this is. It's perfect. Do you see that? If you're like into a simple nature, basic, like minimal kind of boho or minimal, like even, even, well, you know, it's kind of, this is again, a, a, like a little bit Laura Caldwell, you know, with a little bit of mid-century and the boho mix and stuff. And she does like some simple stuff. This would work. Um, And I love that part of it. Ooh. Anyway, uh, so um, it's $18 and it's number 10. $18, number 10. So it's for soap or lotion. And you could go on their website and you can get the proper fitted um, attachment for the pump. All right, Shannon, you got it. Yeah, I don't know if like a basic one would fit or not, so I don't know. Okay, the oh, this didn't sell. Oh, I love this thing. This thing is so awesome for straws. Or, you know, will we I wasn't sure. I thought at first I was like, oh, maybe it is for um, the combs and stuff, but then somebody said, you know, it wouldn't have, it would have something at the bottom for the liquid and stuff for the barbicide or whatever it said on there. So I just need to clean this up a little bit. It's so cool. Still has a tiny bit of red paint, I guess, on there from, it probably said like, you know, straws or soda or, or maybe there was pretzels in here. They might have their pretzels in here. Pull that out and get you a pretzel. For a nickel or whatever it was. Hi, Denise. Straws on your bar cabinet. Exactly. So this is $25 and it's number 15. And you can put a label there if you wanted to. Right there. Right there. It's gorgeous, yeah. It's $25, number 15. I think I found a green one one time before. Lesta, you got it. No, not an offer. I, I just did a price on it. Lest I got it. All right. What else have we got left? Oh, yeah, this thing. I love this thing so much. This teal bottle, like woven bottle. It's, um, and you have no mods. I have mods. Why, was there something wrong? I do have mods. Um, This is about seven and a half inches, I forgot. 
It's teal. Why, is there a problem? Oh, okay. Um, it's, it's tightly woven down there. Then it's got a little more opening here. And it's tighter up here. And it's got this cool, like, handle that you can, like, just hang it like that. Or you can just have it here. And it's just, you know, however. It's just kind of, this is kind of flexible or whatever you want to call it. It just looks cool. This, I think, would look so good with feathers or pompous grass, whatever. Um, even just some cool sticks. Right now, forsythia, like a few little forsythia branches. I don't know. This is that true teal color. I just love this. It's $15, and it's number four. $15, number four. Yeah, you could totally hang this off of a hook or something because it's not, it's, it's not terribly heavy, I don't think. Yeah, and I don't think I, no. <laughs> yeah, so $15, number four. Okay, Jen. Jen, you got it. All right. And so I also have this little um, planter that I had gotten in like a bunch of stuff that I got. I don't know, and it was in there. And it's cracked on this side right here. I like number 38. Okay. Okay, Brie. I got you. Let me write you down real quick. For 15. Thank you. So it's got like this drip glaze. And on the one side, it's cracked. But it's, it's fine on the inside. And I... It's, I like that it's kind of crude, you know, just kind of has a lot of this, like, you know, like the crusty, rusty, dusty. And, um, and there's a stone stuck on here. So this would be cute for, like, I don't know, honestly, like a, a bamboo, a piece of bamboo, you know? Just poke myself almost in the eye. Almost. I just missed it. Wow, that was close. Very close. I'm okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> For a change. Um, anyhow, I don't know. I do have some... Uh, I did buy some because I'm going to use it in some other stuff. But that would look cool in here, something like a, a bamboo. Um, and so it is cracked, so I'm only doing $8. Even though the crack's not going all the way through, it's $8 and it's number 13 $8, number 13. Uh, did you get the first one or the second one, Virginia? I got the second one on Monday. And, I mean, sometimes I still feel a little pain. Like, if I'm doing something, I'll feel, like, a little pain in that arm. But otherwise, I, I was a little tired on Tuesday right after the sale, which was about the 24-hour mark for me. And I just laid down. I couldn't sleep, but I was just tired. I get tired a lot, so I wasn't sure if that was it or not, but I'm fine. Luckily, knock on wood. So, okay, nobody for this then? All right. Um, okay, this candle. Oh, just love this. This candle, it does have a little bit of a ding right here. But again, you know, that's because they don't keep these things wrapped and they're moving stuff around. It is made in China, but I don't care about that. It's the it's the look, it's the vibe, it's the everything. This is great. Yeah, I had Pfizer. I'm I, I'm really quite fine. Um, so anyhow, it's just a super cool candle. It's gonna be ten dollars and it's number two. Ten dollars, number two. Put that candle on the vase. On what vase? That candle is too big for anything that I have. 
Um, so also have this uh, little green glass, which I, I mean, it's, you know, it's like flashed or something because you can see a little bit of the color come off but at the top a little bit. But I would totally put uh, like a um, LED candle, like a tea, tea light at the bottom of this. Maybe tie a little raffia around there or tie or like have like a little um, keychain or bracelet of something that you like. You know, like sometimes I find things that have a little um, uh, elephant or something and I tie it around something or hang it around something and then it drops right there. It looks so cute to do it that way. And I'll be doing a kitchen or a living room tour as soon as I get my living room done. I'll do another, you know, thing. So anyhow, this was $8 and it's number 27. $8, number 27. Oh yeah, these are super cool when you light them and you get that, oh, they're so good. Yeah, I mean, you can't really get the same effect by me showing it like that. Because it's, you know, it's, just, it's not the same. Unfortunately. Okay. So, uh, so we got that and that and that and... Yeah, this. Oh, this is so good. It's the Chianti bottle made in Italy. Uh, this is the one I think would look so cool with like a, a... This is the one where you make like all the different wax melting. So you do a candle and you let melt all melt all down. And then you put another one and you melt, melt all down. And you let it get all like chunky and stuff with all the all the wax and stuff you just have to be careful because you know you got this around the base which is super cool and it's done really well really nice really nice little bottle it is uh ten dollars and it's number 17 ten dollars number 17 Oh, Shannon, you got it. All right, this next one is the the Hallmark piece. This is Hallmark. And it's got the felt on the bottom. It's got a little bit of weight to it. I believe it to be something of a paperweight with this beautiful little scene, nature. But then also a pen or pencil holder because back in the day you know hallmark is all about like the cards and the stationery and stuff so isn't that nice wouldn't that have been nice on a, on a young lady's desk set probably, there probably was a whole set with it but this is cute for on your desk or something right <laughs> so this is you know what i'll mark this one down I'm going to mark it down to 12. This is going to be $12. And it's number 36. $12, number 36. Okay. Um, next up is this basket that is six dollars. Six dollars and it is just about seven, almost just under seven by five. And it is Six dollars, it's number 18. Six dollars, number 18. It's nice and sturdy. Cute little basket. You got this cool vase. Green and gold. It's USA. It's just, it's got nice crazing down there. 
Nice drip of the green. Yes. <laughs> right, Jen? It is $15. And I will actually mark it down to $12. And $12 and it's number 12. $12, number 12. Debbie Spilker. Yay. Thank you, Daddy. I love this cup. <laughs> I just love this cup. It's it's by Zach. It's so it's a reproduction. I just love it, and I love that it's like oval and not totally round. I think it would be for like, I think it would be for like toothbrushes for a kid's bathroom or something. Would look so cute. But you can use this for your pens and pencils in your office or something. Or I think it's super cute to have on hand and use for, like, if your children, you know, bring you some dandelions from outside. That would look super cute in here. Or, you know, like, some, just, like, clip a few flowers from outside that you have, like, your, maybe your daffodils or, you know, something. You can clip them down a little bit or your hyacinths even. It might not look, those might not look so cute in here. But, you know, um, I, th I don't know about drinking unless you made it the long way, then that probably would work just because of it's being oval. I'm not sure. Um, I just think it's a great, I just think it's a great cup and it's $10 and it's number 49, $10, number 49. Okay, you guys, that's it. That is it. That's all I've got left. I have the Little Drip Glaze vase. I have the big, fat, colorful candle. I can do eight. Would somebody like this for eight? Yeah, me too. <laughs> Would somebody like this for eight? Thank you, classic old soul. I try not to do, you know, I mean, we're like at the three hour mark, right? I used to do much longer sales. I talk a lot. Um, I'm trying also not to go too far past the 50 item mark. Um, when I have boho, I can't help myself. I just can't. Um, <laughs> I just love it. I love it. So is anybody interested in this for $8? It does have this little bit of a ding on it, but it's okay. It's okay. You wouldn't see that if you turn it this way. No, nobody, nobody, nobody. All right. So we got that. We got the... <clears throat> The um, pen holder, which I think is so sweet. I don't know. When I was a little girl, I had the, like the, what was that big piece called that, and it had, you could put like new paper inside of it, like the desk, like protector or whatever. And it would have like a matching like address book. And then you would, or, or like the thing for your pen or your cup for your, I had the whole, oh my gosh, I loved having my desk and all the drawers and they had all my things. Oh, I was such a, I was a hoarder then. <laughs> so, okay, nobody with that. All right, I don't have much else. Uh, let's see. And then that small basket and then this green thing. So, orange. That's it. That is it, everybody. Thank you so much for a great sale. I appreciate it. Um, thank you, Jen. Jen. 
I know. Well, Jen, I um, you get in touch with me. Literally, like, I things are gonna start. You know, like once it gets to be closer to summer, I'm gonna be starting to get busier and busier. Um, but this weekend, I, I someday I have to take my dog to the vet to Petco between one and three, so she can get her annual like her shots or whatever. Um, but yes, I can. I almost took it today, but I have to read. I keep forgetting to send that to you. So I'll just like, yeah, I got you, Brie. <laughs> oh, thanks, Lesta. So, um, yeah, I'm going to get everything from Tuesday done now with this. And, um, if, um, there's anything you guys have any questions about, just let me know. But um, I think we're all good here. Only had a few things that didn't sell. So I'm happy with that. Thank you so much. You guys, make sure that you've given me a thumbs up. I know it's dwindling because other people are having sales now too. Um, so, and also everybody doesn't love Boho. So that's fine too, right? Oh, thanks, Tammy. My email, it, uh, Debbie, I have you. You're Deborah, right? I have you. It's comfy, cozy living at gmail.com. But Debbie, I have you. <laughs> Did you get my package yet from last week? You might have, or you might be getting it any day. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much, Jeannie. Jeannie, you're so sweet. And I, I know you always wanted that list for me, and I never did send it to you. I should. I know. But anyway, yes. I love the chit chat with you guys, too. And, oh, that creepy baby, somebody asked about it. Somebody did. No, I'm going to. I No, I'll do that off. Um, I, somebody did ask me about that, and I have to email them back. And if they don't want to, if they don't agree on a price, then it'll be in Tuesday's sale. So, um, yeah, that's it then, you guys. Make sure you give me a thumbs up. Make sure that... Uh, that you're subscribed. I need to make sure that everybody is subscribed and um, also hit the, you know, notification bell. So, um, yeah, next Tuesday's sale will be, I believe, will be on Misty's channel. Thrifter, Junker, Vintage Hunter. I'm sure you guys all know that. If you're here and you don't know Misty, then I'm shocked. <laughs> so, um, yeah. Yeah. Everybody, uh, thank you so much for being here. And I um, I appreciate it. Thank you, Gina. I appreciate it much. And um, I, uh, I will see you Tuesday at our sale. Next week's sale is going to be a sale called Collections. And let me give you a little, just a little, you know, like overall pop on that. It, it will be collections. It will be like swans or birds or cats or dogs or milk glass or vases, or planters, or, you know, things that people collect. Oh, pictures, personal pictures. I have a lot, personal creamers, those kind of things. I, you guys, I don't know what the big deal is about the wrenches. I don't see that there was any problem. I do have people that have wrenches. I don't... They don't, they, they signify nothing. They really just make you have to do more work. I, I don't know. There's no big whoop in, in the wrenches. You guys, they did, they're not a badge of honor. They're not a, they don't make you any more important than anybody else to me. I love my people all the same. You don't all need to have a wrench. And yeah, there were no problems. Um, 
honestly, the more people that have wrenches, a lot of times there's just having to be issues because people accidentally touch something and then boom, you got, you know, like somebody put in time out accidentally or something that happens to the best of us too. And uh, so don't worry about the wrenches. If I, if I have a situation, then, you know, you know, I'll, I'll, but I have, an, I, I believe I have, yeah, I believe I have plenty of, you know, they might not be here right now, but if they weren't needed, then that's okay too. And also Misty is a wrench and she is here. She's just not here. She's not in the chat. She listens while she's, uh, she's got it on her big TV while she's packing orders and stuff. So, um, anyway, you guys, um, just, yeah, enjoy, just, yeah, just enjoy it. <laughs> um, I know other people do something about the whole wrench situation. It's really not a, it, and trust me, I love you all the same. And I, I sincerely mean this, like you are all important to me. A wrench doesn't make you uh, more important than anybody else. So sorry. Um, so yeah, thank you guys so much for making this a successful sale. Next week's collections sale will be things that you might be already collecting and you're missing one of these things in the collection or, oh, thank you. Classic old soul. What's your name? Um, or it might be something that you already collect, but you don't have this one that I'm going to show. And you might want that one. So it's going to be, or you might be like, oh, I like what she's got. And all of a sudden you have an instant collection because you're buying them all. So it's going to be, the, it's going to be like, kind of like a mixed bag. Because that's, I, I got to keep it mixed up for everybody to be interested, right? So, Linda, thanks. Great. Are you one of my Lindas or are you new to me? Because I have a few Lindas already. But, I mean, not wrong with that. <laughs> I'd just like to know if it's somebody I already know and I'm being rude by not realizing that. So, um... Yeah, I see the numbers dwindling because I know other sales are going on. So you guys go and enjoy all the other sales. Go and enjoy your weather. Uh, I love a newbie. Welcome. Thank you for joining us. Make sure you've got, make sure you're, um, you're subscribed and all that jazz, uh, Linda. We'll be all good. So um, yeah. And don't forget Tuesday on Misty Sale, the three-way threes company. We generally do some things that are maybe a little they tend to be a little more leveled up <laughs> sometimes, but um, still affordable and just amazing items. So um, yeah, you will definitely uh, enjoy that. If you enjoy me just alone, you will totally enjoy me with Misty and Michael. So thanks you guys for being here today and hanging out and go enjoy the rest of your day. And make sure that I have your information. And I love you. So uh, I'm going to say goodbye. And I am going to go try to clean up my living room. And then I'm going to get started on packing things up. All right. Have a great day, you guys. Thank you so much. Love you. Bye.